So in this video, we are going to convert the octal to decimal. Okay, so octal base is nothing but 8 and decimal base is 10. So 8 to 10 we are going to convert. So 8 basically means what we are having the numbers from 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So totally how many numbers are there? 8 numbers are there. For decimal we are having 10 different symbols that is denoted by 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So total how many numbers are there? 9, uh, 10 numbers are there. That means 0 to 9. Okay. So how to convert? So as we discussed before in the binary to decimal also, whenever you are going to convert anything to decimal, okay, we are going to multiply with what numbers? If it is octal, multiply with the base. What is the base of octal 8? So based on that 8 power, we have to going to multiply. So here we can see the decimal point is there, binary point is there or the decimal point you can consider. Okay, no need to consider binary, just a point is there. So whenever you are going to convert the uh, octal to by a decimal we have to consider left hand side in the ascending form of the powers that means 8 power 0 it will start on the right hand side it will start from minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 same as case of what binary to decimal but since it is octal to decimal we have to consider 8 power that's the only difference okay so same thing uh, here also is the same thing so 8 power minus 1 can be written as 1 by 8 8 power minus 2 can be written as 1 by 8 square which is 8 1 by 64 like that it will go on now we will directly go for the problem. So we are, here we are having the question number 1. <clears throat> so what is the question? 352 which is in the octal form we have to convert into decimal. So 352 I will just write it. So directly you have to convert. Just from right hand side you start. From 2 you start. Below that you write 8 power 0, 8 power 1, 8 power 2. Now you will ask me that 8 power minus 1 where it is gone. Right. So here, since there is no decimal point over here, there is no point given in the question. So we can consider point over here also. Because if I write 200, it basically means it is 200.0. So here also a three, it is 352. It basically means 352.0 something. So whenever 0 is there, no need to consider that all. Right. 8 power minus 1, no need to consider that because there is no decimal point. So we have directly start from the right hand side, start with 8 power 0, 8 power 1, 8 power 2, like that go on. Now just to keep multiplying and add, add and multiply, multiply and add. You can start from left hand side or right hand side, okay, anything is fine, just to, for the multiplication purpose. So I will start from the left hand side, so 3 is the number, 8 power 2 I have to multiply, plus 5 is the number, 8 power 1 I have to multiply, plus 2 is the number again and I have to multiply with 8 power 0. So 3 into it will become 8 square is what 64 plus 5 into 8 plus 8 power 1 is 8. Okay. So what is 8 power 0? Anything power 0 is what? 1. So it is 2 into 1. So what will be the answer? 3 into 64, 192 plus 5 8s are 40 plus 2 into 1 is 2. So total answer will be 234. And you have to put the base as what? 10. So this is the final answer. Okay. So whenever you are converting, uh, converting into the decimal, always remember in that numbers, you will be getting only from 0 to till what? 9. These numbers always will be there. You can observe 2 is there, 3 is there, 4 is there. All the numbers will be there from 0 to 9 since it is the base 10. But the question also if you observe, the numbers won't be there 8 and 9. They won't give you 8 and 9. Since uh, the octal number always contains till what? 0 till 7. So 8 and 9 is won't be there. Right? The simple logic. Now here decimal point has come. First let me just write 127.24. So decimal point is there. On the right hand side what it will, uh, it will be there? 8 power minus 1, 8 power minus 2. On the left hand side it will be 8 power 0, 8 power 1 and 8 power 2. Just to start multiplying. You can start from left or right. Anything is fine. So 1 into 8 power 2 plus 2 into 8 power 1 plus 7 into 8 power 0 plus 2 into 8 power minus 1 plus 4 into 8 power minus 2. So this is 1 into 8 square is 64 plus 2 into 8 plus 7 into 8 power 1 is 1 plus 2 into 8 power minus 1 is 1 by 8 plus 4 into 8, 8 power minus 2 is what? 1 by 8 square. What is 1 by 8 square? 1 by 64. So directly write 1 by 64. So it will be 64 plus 16 plus 7 plus 2 ones are 2 fours are 
4 ones are 4 16 so 1 by 4 plus 1 by 16 so you can directly put it in the calculator you will get you will be getting the answer as 87.3125 and the base will be 10 okay so this is how you have to do decimal point so decimal and without decimal you have studied how to convert octal to binary